This is the first investigation of 2023. We find ourselves at a wool mill in Bradford, and here's Mark to tell you an encounter they had. Um, uh, we, we were doing slats and gears here, and there was just here. And there's a sort of similar carts downstairs, a wooden one with these sort of uh, wheels on. Yeah. And we heard this noise, you know, when we've been up there, and it, it sounded like this. Right, across there. I looked at him and he looked at me and we, I said, did you hear that? I went, yeah. I went, should we go? He went, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Even the next day in the daylight. Even cold it, it, No, he didn't. went down rather than yeah. up. We just, we just went home. Yeah. Um, Thomas Collins was the original guy who built it. And there was a story about him that um, it had gone into liquidation on, and on the day of the auction, because his sons wanted to carry it on, um, he died on the day of the auction and they took it out of the auction at the last minute. Wow. And then they carried on with it. And there's loads of little things that are, that are ready, old newspapers. And, yeah. Um, I was just, just telling the guy today, it was here. On the not this floor, but the floor below. Um, there was two lads, what, 1800 and something or other, doing something in the windows, and one fell out. All right, spirits, we're we're just here to, as I say, extend a hand and see anyone who is, firstly, in this building, any workers, or maybe even any family members of the people present. Come in uh, an exploration, is that? Pressure change. So we've done this many times and had some very compelling replies in various forms. Warm spot. Well, yeah. There's been sounds in here before of maybe people working and we would just love you to come forward. Are you trying to move this? Planchette. That's one of the isn't it? Alright, good. Can you make it go higher? Give us strength and that energy. <laughs> <laughs> I'll try and pick up your speed. Thank you. Oh, I like some black outside. Okay. Are you a male? Yes or no? No. Okay, back to the middle, please. Talking to a lady, yeah? Okay. I don't know if that was wind, it just sounded like someone went okay. in my ear, but. Well, it took my ear behind me. Yeah. Alright, do you want to move around this board and see what energy you've got? Because moving around can really strengthen. Maybe it's the static or the movement. Thanks. Are you from Bradford? Yes. Right, spirit, move if you're... Water. Water. Yeah. Move if you're willing to talk by this. Let's see if you uh, yeah. have some thoughts there. D. Yeah. Ada, yeah. is that your name? Yeah. Ada, lovely to meet you. Do you know anyone around this board? Do you know Mark? Do you initially know an Ada at all? Okay. <coughs> Did you ever work in this mill? Yeah. Oh, what year was this? Sort of. What year did you start working here? One. Eight. Do you know how, long, how old this mill is? One, eight, nine. Nine. Eighteen ninety-nine. Is that within the realm of this yeah. being open? Ada, how many um, spirits are, are with us? Just you or three? Can you copy me? Music. Yeah, I'm going to say uh, there's something in there, but it's not. Yeah, it sounds calm. Mm -hmm. I don't know what that means. Vera, but it's not how you spell it, is no, it? No, it's usually V E R A. Yeah, just spell Vera. Yeah, I know. Do you mean, do you mean the name Vera? Yes. N. Is that An Anderson. Anderson? Yeah. Ah. Yeah, we're just talking about that, yeah. Vera Anderson. Vera wasn't spelled right. 
much to say about it, but I didn't no. see it being really spelled. Do you want to put your phone you on somebody and see whether that's the old spelling? Maybe she married somebody called Anderson, uh, maybe she's not English as such. So what area, did you, were you from Bradford? What area of Bradford did you live in then? Lime what? S T Lime Street, you gotta check Lime Street for Lime Street Bradford is a place. Yeah, Lime Street Bradford, yeah. Alright. <coughs> yeah, see if it's close. Fair enough. We, we've been to other mills before, Ada and Vera. Seven minutes away. Come here. Yeah, I don't know if you're dying, but that's probably what? not. How did you die? Do you, can you remember what finally got you? Was it age or. W H O O P Whoop. That's what I thought it was. E. Died here. You didn't work here, but you died what close to here, outside of the building? Yes. Oh, what was that? What was what? Did anybody else hear that? No. What were it? Like a shuffle. I heard that bit. Okay, too. Like a... I don't know, I'll show you. Like that. Like that. It was like... I don't know, it was like... I felt like it was more like a footstep. I heard it like a... Have you shown yourself to anyone who works here? Is anyone called with a K name here? Karina. Karina. No. Do you think Karina saw you though? No. Sorry, I'm not Was it Toilet. Um, toilet. Um, which level? If this is the fourth level, which, which level toilet? Three. Is it all one I went to? Does anyone work on three? Is that the toilet I went to? Uh, right, Vera, there's, you know, a few floors in here. Is there another floor that maybe you think we should check out? Oh. Zero? You've got a basement? Yes. Interesting. Can we get, can we get in there? Yeah. May I ask how old you are in your current state? Nine. Nine. Else you want you want to go to the top floor? Do you want to go to there's yeah, there's two other spirits. There's a Vera and there's a Ada. And they currently are on the top floor. What was me? Are you wanting to go and join them? Right, so how many spirits are in in this cellar now? Because this could get confusing otherwise. Two. two. That makes sense. Okay. That does make sense. So is this the other spirit? Is this a new spirit? All right. So you uh, you identify as demonic. Do you do you call yourself demonic? No. It seems like you don't want to be bothered. Is that right? Nobody you want nobody bothering you. So I'm going to say you're not actually harmful. You're not the most. You basically you just don't want to be bothered. You don't want the you people want to just to be left alone. You. Adrian, I'm taking it that that's you. There's three spirits up here. Is that what you're saying, yes or no? Mm. And so that's you, Vera, and this girl. Yes or no? Mm. Yes. Okay, cool. So yeah, we met this guy, potentially called Mr. Y, and he, he does seem to be grumpy and scaring people, but... <clears throat> yeah, but he just wants to be left alone, so I wouldn't even bother him to be honest. But if you could look after this girl, I'd really appreciate it. Is she... Oh, she was still not been moved. Yeah. Okay. That's what they were trying... If they were trying to move something, what was it? So Jill here and Lucy seem to think that 
something was trying to be moved or was moved. We sat on the second floor. Um, did he be in peace on there? Mm. Not a lot. No. Um, but kind of like while we were playing it back, yep. when I'd asked if you could make a noise on the recording, there was nothing but as the recording said it, mm -hmm. we got something. Yeah. Mm -hmm. it, was, it was like one of the boxes was knocked, kind of thing. Um, and then it, it kind of grew a little bit from then, but then most of it was up on level three. Okay. So is that beneath us? It's below here. So we've been on there and we thought it was the the door. Yeah. Yeah, the door. Um, and we've had cameras on that and everything. We, we can't get yeah. that. And then we suddenly realised we think it was the trolley. Really? That, that was kind of creaking. So we've had a bit of a play and we are convinced that it was the big trolley that's at the side of the, is there like a door that goes outside? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah the big trolley there. We've, we've discounted the outside door mm. uh, and everything. We can only get it to, to be the side of the trolley. Well, I think for tonight we're done. Mm. So we'll do take protection off now. Thank you.